Welcome back to my channel, Inifini here. Hi, my name is Stephanie, and for today's video, we're building a planner from Wrong Wrong's brand new planner collection. And as you can see, I do have both layouts. I also have covers and dividers and discs and just all of the things. But in case you missed the detailed flip through of this release, I'll go ahead and link that at the end of this video. And remember that you guys can save an automatic 10% off of your order using the affiliate link linked down in the description box below. And as always, I truly do appreciate that but if you build a planner just like we're doing today by choosing a layout cover with dividers and a set of discs you guys can save 25% off so definitely keep that in mind so as far as the layouts you can either choose between the dashboard layout or the vertical layout so let's just quickly look at these layouts let's go ahead um, and start with the dashboard layout so we're going to get the name page here. And then as soon as we flip it, we have dock right on the left. And then we have like a top three priority, maybe a to-do list. We do have these two sections here. And as we flip the page, that is going to lead us right to our very first monthly view. And as you can see, there is no color or design whatsoever. And so as we flip the page, we have lines over here on the left-hand side. And again, we have dot grid here on the right. And then once we flip it over, we have the dashboard layout. So as far as the left-hand page, we have a section for to-do. Then we do have priorities and habit tracking here. There is this blank section here here followed by some dot grid down here at the bottom and then as far as the right hand side we are going to get Monday through Sunday and then there is a section for next week but as you can see Monday through Sunday have this little extra section here for maybe something important or whatever you need it to be because I mean the possibilities are endless and I truly love love this layout i really fell in love with it as soon as i saw it and so i believe because it is undated we're going to get five weeks so here is one two three four and five yeah and then we're going to start all over again so i really love this layout i love that everything is on the right hand page that way if you flip your planner you still get the whole weekly view so i am loving this planner so let's go ahead and put it off to the side and let's go ahead and look at the weekly layout so again, we're going to get the name page, then dock right on the left, we have this page here on the right, we have the monthly view, and then we have the line page over here and the dock grid on the right hand page. And then here is the vertical layout. So as far as the sidebar, we have a blank section on top, we do have habit tracking followed by dot grid down here at the bottom and then we're going to do monday through sunday and what i love about this vertical layout is that it is not sectioned off because normally with a vertical layout you do get three sections here but i love how clean this looks i think it looks amazing so yeah once again because it is undated we're going to get five weeks so that was one two three, four, and five. And then we're going to do it all over again. So these are such amazing layouts. Wrong Wrong has worked so hard to create these. And actually, she did run a contest. And we have planner babes in the community that helped her with these two layouts. And so here are their information. They are just amazing. And once again, I'll go ahead and leave all of this information linked down in the description box below. But I think that as far as building my own planner... Um, I think that I am going to go with the dashboard layout. You guys know that I'm all about my lines. And so the dashboard definitely checks that off. But just keep in mind that this vertical layout is available. And I think that it's amazing because it is not sectioned off. So let's go ahead and maybe put that one off to the side. And then now that we have chosen our layout, now it's time to choose 
our cover with dividers. And as you can see, we have four options here. So the very first option is going to be this live in the moment cover and all of the covers are matte as you can see there is no glare and it feels amazing i wish you guys could feel them they truly feel so so nice and look at the inside cover so we have this live in the moment collection and then we also have this one which is coffee queen here is the um front and then this is the inside and then here we have planner bean and then we also have bookworm and this is the inside and i think they are all so beautiful so we get to choose the cover and the dividers and we also get to choose a set of discs and i was actually sent the black one and i am so happy about that and these are actually metal Disc. but there's also different colors to choose from and there is also a clear option and i actually went ahead and ordered some clear discs on launch day so i cannot wait to receive them but black is definitely my go-to along with clear discs so because we do have the black i feel like they would go with any of these covers i think they would all look amazing with this one but I think they would look so pretty with the live in the moment um, pack. Because if I show you guys, um, let me see, let me put that off to the side. If I show you the dividers that come with this pack, they are just all so beautiful. And they are all double sided. So let me just quickly show you this one. I love how neutral this one is. It is just very, very beautiful. And so here is the inside of the back cover and the back cover. So yeah, I feel like I'm going to go with this one. I just love the vibe and the color scheme. But let me just quickly show you the rest of these because they are all so beautiful. So I wish you guys good luck between choosing any of these um what are they any of these covers and dividers so here is the inside here is the very first divider and look at the beautiful color scheme we have the purple and brown and black and then we also have like the pinks and reds and it is just all so beautiful and then here is the inside of the back cover and the very bag. So again, this one is Coffee Queen. And then we have Bookworm. So as far as this one, we are going to get that like dark aesthetic. And it is just so beautiful as well. Look at how pretty this is. We already have like a notebook not a notebook but a reading journal and it was just stunning so i am glad that we get the same option in a planner and cover and dividers so so beautiful so here is the back cover with this one and last but not least we have planner babe so here is the inside and here are the dividers such a neutral color scheme i am really loving this one as well she does have rose gold disc and i feel like those ones would look so pretty with this option but look at how beautiful this one is very very pretty oh my gosh so yeah they are all so beautiful so definitely good luck choosing an option because they are all amazing but like i said i am going to choose the live in the moment collection i think it is just so beautiful so let's bring in the black metal discs because the first thing that i like to do I'm a bit rusty with discs, but the first thing that I like to do is add 
the cover to the discs. So I went ahead and grabbed both the front and the back cover and I am simply going to add these. So here's that and then we do have one more and we do have two leftovers. So we do get 11 here. So let's go ahead and open her up. And now I think that I'm going to go ahead and add the layout. I think that is going to be um, the best or easiest option. So this is a 12 month planner. And so all I'm going to do is grab a few pages and just pop them in. And now let's add the last part. Okay, so yeah, I think she is already looking amazing. And look at the black disc. She is looking so fabulous already. Okay, so now I think that we are good to go to add the dividers so as you can see this is the name page so then we're gonna flip it over and like i said we get that dot grid and then we also get this page right before the monthly view so i think that this is where the divider would go so maybe this could be like a currently page to start the month and then this could be like what is going on for the month before we go into the monthly view, right? I think that's the way that it should be set up. So let's kind of go ahead and keep going and see how we feel about it because it would definitely not go here and I don't think that it would go here either. So we're going to count five of the week. So one, two, three, four, and five. And then we are going to place this divider here. Oh my gosh, it is coming along and it is super easy to build this planner. So again, we're going to count five weeks. So one, two, three, four, and five. So let's go ahead and add another divider here. And technically we don't have to um, count because it just automatically just flows and we know exactly where we need to place that other divider. So it is not too bad. I seriously thought that I was going to get lost and not know exactly what to do, especially because we're building it on our own. But as you can see, it is so easy. So let's go ahead and place another divider here. And let's keep flipping. I think we should still be on the right track. Hopefully, I don't notice that I did something wrong along the way or while I'm editing this video. But like I said, it looks super, super easy. So the monthly view, then we get these two pages. And then one, two, three, four, and five. Okay. So yeah, I think we should be on the right path. So there's that and then here's the monthly view, these two pages and then one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so here is the very last divider and the rest of the planner. Oh, and we actually get some dot grid pages. I hadn't even noticed that. So let's count. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven dot grid pages. Oh my gosh, I hadn't noticed that before. So I'm glad that I checked. And so let's go ahead and check out the planner that we just built. She looks amazing all the way around. I seriously love the black 
this with this theme i think it looks so beautiful so collect beautiful moments we have the name page and that quickly leads us into this dog grid page along with the very first divider and actually now that i think about it I really love that because usually with other planners, you get a lot of pages here in the front before you actually get to your first divider. And this seems super duper simple and exactly what I look for in a planner. Sometimes I don't even use all of these pages here in the front. So that is definitely a plus for me. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but I really love that. So here is the first pages here um, after this divider. So again, we're gonna get those five weeks and then we're gonna go on to the next divider. And oh my gosh, let's just kind of flip through it because it is just so beautiful. So here we have this one, this one, this one. Oh my gosh, they are so pretty. So yeah, as you can see, it was so easy to build a planner for 2025 or even sooner depending on how impatient you are but i really love this i think it is so beautiful so again remember that you guys can save 25 percent off if you choose to build a planner just like we did by choosing the disc cover and dividers along with the layout and in case you guys just kind of want to pick and choose a few things here and there be sure to use the affiliate link linked down in the description box below so you guys can save an automatic 10% off of your order so don't forget that we also have the vertical layout and then we also have the option of coffee queen as our cover and divider then we also have bookworm and then we also have um planner babe as well and then don't forget that we also have sticker books with this release which are gonna be um cozy winter and jingle all the way like i said this collection is so beautiful so if you guys haven't checked out the detailed flip through be sure to click here on the screen as i will have it here but for now i am so obsessed with the way that our planner turned out and i cannot wait to come back and do a plan with me in this planner so definitely stay tuned for that but for now, I am obsessed with the way that this planner turned out. So if you like this video, please consider subscribing. And don't forget to check me over on Instagram at Stephanie Happily Plans. And I'll see you next time.